thrusters were deactivated. Just in time. Hey, Goro. Wow, you look like a million eddies. Is that so? That is not how I feel. I ate what you call a scat burger. Uh-huh. <laughs> and what'd you think, tasty? Ask the people below. The parade will soon begin. I adjusted the data from Okada-san. I advise you to examine it yourself. To begin with, the malware works. Truly, much better than I anticipated. Our eyes and ears are in the guard room. I observe the CCTV and I know where the sniper positions are. They are a trio. You must make each harmless before they do the same to me. There are many ways to reach them. The first is nearby. He should not be a problem. The second is worse. You will have to climb. As for the third, he hides on the footbridge over the street. We are here. Hanako-sama's platform will stop here. Close to the emergency exit we will use when all is done. From these points, you will have a clear view of the parade, but the snipers will see things even better. If they notice you, bang, no more thing. If this sounds dangerous, consider that I must leap to the float, enter through a window and meet Hanako-sama face to face. The last is what I fear the most. Is all this clear? Are you ready? Plans fuck beyond all recognition. Yet here I am. I know, and I thank you for this. Thank me once it works. I get in position. Very well. Wait for my signal. Stay safe, Goro. Thank you. 
He's almost in front of you. He's watching the crowd, not his back. Oh no, I hit him. Maybe some other time. It's going. Uh, yeah, slowly. Same old, same old. I know that borged out ogre. Adam fucking smasher. Guy killed you, right? Guy, motherfucker's barely human. But hey, know what? I'm glad he's here. You're glad? Seeing as I woke up in a world without any Sabura, I'll have to be satisfied with Smasher. You gotta be satisfied. You got fuck all to lose. All right, fine, we. 
Your finger on the fucking trigger, I guess. Try to reach the maintenance area. You can climb up from there. Kenwalk don't look too stable. Fuck! Kenwalk, you must not draw attention.
You will have to get down somehow. Just be careful. Yes. Just so. Don't rush. I need you alive. Not the corpse below. Saburo Arasaka. Pilot in the SAR squadron in the rank of Master Sergeant. Founder and CEO of the largest and greatest Hello? Where are you? Soldier.
Shit, not good. on yourself too. No, you didn't have to. You'd have done the same to me. You saw it. I will remember this. 
There should be nothing standing in your way now. We press forward. Okay, Preem. Online and in the system. Surrender immediately! Hanako's inside. What is she doing? Trying to call someone, I think. Try to listen. Do not forget to disarm the alarms. I must be able to... I'm not going to be able to do anything. If you're not going to be able to do anything, you're not going to be able to do anything. Who's the name of your name? I'm. 私が参加したのはあくまでもお父様を追悼するため操り人形になるためじゃないわこの見せ物ではみんなに役割がある美智子は文句を言ってないぞだがお前が言うなら中止してもいい全部やめだお前の安全が第一だからな兄さんやり終えましょうありがとう花子せっかくの式典だやり終えなければ悔いが残るゴロオシステムスジャンプスナウネブルお父様花子様あなたはお許しをどうか話だけでもお聞きくださいサブロー様は父のことを口にしないこれが俺にできる最後のご奉仕なのですサブロー様の死について真実を明かすことは花子様無礼を働きたくありませんしかしビンラウンシェッシェッシェッシェッ He shot her Well now we're really fucked Knew we couldn't trust him What happened to keeping him on his leash We best delta the fuck out of here
Are you secure? Yeah, for now. Lost your fucking mind. There's no time to explain. We must meet. Where are you? An abandoned apartment block on Vine Street. Second floor, number 303. Knock four times. Hurry! I look okay to you? We're about to go live. inside. Quick. I fear they had a coach. Now are you gonna tell me what the fuck you were thinking? I used a sedative. She tried to enable her tracker. I had no choice. I offered her some tea. You kidnap Hanako Arasaka and offer her a cup of fucking tea. Yes. She respectfully declined. Tell her the truth about Yorinobu. No embellishment. And state your terms clearly. Perhaps to you, she will listen. Hanako-sama, kare ga rei no jinbutsu desu. Dou ka hanashi o kiite agete. I was there that night at Kanpeki Plaza. I saw Saburo Arasaka die. He wasn't poisoned. That's a lie your brother made up and spread. Yorinobu is the murderer. You must be mad to think I will listen to such nonsense. Why? My word means shit to you? Hanako-sama, I apologize on his behalf. Oh, shut up, Goro. We're supposed to be honest. Well, that's what I'm being. 
Fine. Maybe I am just a two-bit thief. But I'm the two-bit thief that stole that fucking relic off you. Slotted it in, took a bullet to the brain, died. You... died? Oh yeah. And now I got Johnny fucking Silverhand in there, and I'll do anything to get him out. So I got exactly nothing to lose. But you got lots. Harahosama, he is living proof of the terrible crime your brother committed. We can confirm every word he speaks, if only you will help him with the relic. Hanako-sama. Did you hear that? Go and check. Bad feeling about this. Damn it! Another extremist. On the ground, asshole! Go move! Get the fuck out of here! Takamura! Can't leave him back there! Forget him, guy's toast! Unless you want to wind up like him. Don't you fucking dare float off. Not now. Come on, gotta get the fuck out of the city. Think they make these motels especially for royal fuck-ups like us? AC's busted, dirty needles under the mattress, shitters clogged. No, for real. Who fucking comes here to sleep? We're a couple miles outside Night City. Someone leaving town just keeps driving. Somebody going there sleeps in the damn city. What good's a motel in the middle of nowhere? Johnny? Yeah? 
Shut your gonk mouth, please. Same random shit ain't gonna help anyone. How the tables have turned. Johnny, for crying now out- we're the ones sitting around waiting for Sokka assault squads to storm in. Anyone knocked, blast the fucking door. No warning. Not keen on us ending up like Takamura. Hear that? Car. At this hour, in this place? Fuck. Just one? Finger on the trig, V. For v. Don't touch that door. I know you're in there. Are you asleep? Time to wake up. Who's there? I said, who's there? Oh, want the whole motel to hear, or will you let me in? I'm armed. Don't try anything. Ugh. That on the wall, is that... blood? Yeah. Knocked the last star off this dump. So, you were saying... got a message? Sitting right here. Oh, it'll start soon. What'll start? It's a doll. Poor proxy. Must make one thing clear. I still think you are mad. But... Hanako, that you? But I can fool myself no longer. I believe you. Damn shame you didn't believe me earlier. Goro might have still been alive had you. If you invoke his name, remember he did everything for this conversation to happen. That demands respect. Fine. Yorinobu planted a tanto in the corporation's very heart. I must act while the wound is fresh. And you will help me. You are living proof of his crime and treason. Decided already? Is that it? You're in no position to set conditions. And what if I... obliged you to cooperate? I have to send a swarm of proxies to do that. This here, talking, is because you're alone. You don't have anyone else you can turn to. This is true. So what are your terms? I want to know everything you know about Mikoshi. Mikoshi? One of my father's flagship projects. A data fortress with servers situated on orbital stations all around Earth. Think of it as an archive of personality constructs, digitized psyches. Try a prison. A matter of perspective. In any case, that is not where you will find salvation. Not without extensive knowledge of the relic and the construct creation procedure. Managed to make contact with Alt Cunningham. The Cunningham? The very same who invented Soul Killer. Using her modified version now. That should be more than useful. Track down your runaway. Hellman was hiding under Kang Tao's wing. We chatted. Think sooner or later the engram will completely conceal me. Process can't be stopped. A surprisingly deterministic conclusion for a man of science. At the very least, I got my hands on the relic schematics. Got detailed information about its inner workings. Project tech documentation. All useful. Even more so, given that Hellman is still alive. I will contact him and explain that one does not leave Arasaka by the back door. That's about the extent of what we've got. What now?
Let us meet in person. At Ambers, in the city center. It is discreet. Just remember one thing. From now on, we both must exercise extreme caution. That's my job done. Know what? What? I think I'd have rather had a wave of Sokka meets barging here. We got what we wanted. Don't tell me that proxy got to you. Fuck you. Come on, think about it. Yesterday, Hanako was living in a world that was completely safe for her. What she got on her hands now? A foreign city, a homicidal brother, and a fucking thief. It's why she sent a proxy. She's alone. And she's shitting herself more than we are. Uh-huh. Clink. What? Did you say clink? Mm-hmm. Sound of her attaching her leash. What's up? You got a few more words about the porcelain cunt? Fuck! <coughs> Shit. Get ready. Fuck. Johnny. That smells the sea breeze. Get up. Pacific's beautiful this time of day. Almost flatlined by that attack. Almost. We in uh, Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pistis Sophia, where her sole guest is right now. Wanted to show you something. Come on. Saw the pseudo endotrizine in your hand. Can't very well function in this body without it, right? Got this strange impression your comatose self wanted to get rid of me. Actually put up a good fight. Ugh. Did you want to pop the pill? Coolier Chrome, if I'd wanted full control, I'd have taken it already. Lots earlier. Had doubts. Just when you were gonna drop them, your conscience poked you in the gut. So Johnny Silverhand's got a conscience after all. Christ, can we just <laughs> drop it? Looking for work? Help us build the system. Climb through the window. Can manage that, I think. Uh. You wanted to know why I brought you here. There's a hidey hole where I'm standing. Open it. Empty it. Yours. They were. Belong to you now. Why are you giving me these? Imagine we're deployed together, fighting in a war, side by side. Would you take a bullet for me? No. 
I wouldn't. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. Been thinking about our predicament. Want to be clear, I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get wiped. Tags are proof of my promise. Kind gesture, I guess. But you can't really give me something I already have. Body's mine. Always has been. It's my decision. Not Let's not intruders. talk on it anymore, for now, okay? You seriously considering Hanako's offer? Got a better idea? Not yet, but I got a request. Well? Adam Smasher. Fucker who got the better of me. Whatever happens to me, I want him zero, gone, tossed into the wind as mulch. That your dying wish. Revenge. It's more than that. And I'll need you to take Rogue with you. It's important to me. And it's just as important for her. So, I gotta tell Rogue... everything? Think I'd better do that. Handle it personally. You'll drop the pills from Misty, and I'll steer the ship for a bit. I'm not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out, I promise. Need to know exactly what you plan to do. I'll tell Rogue the truth, see if she's willing to help. Hey, Satan kicked me out of hell, thought I'd swing by. All I gotta do is mention Smasher. Serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old days. Easy. Need to think it over. Sure, thanks. This is important to me, V. Just get me to the afterlife and hop in the back seat for a bit, that's all. Feeling better. Should get going. Still feel a sharp something near your heart. Doubt that's ever going away. The hotel pissed to Sophia. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Good place to die. Just not today. Judy. So, you got a plan? Damn right I do. Come over to mine tonight. Gonna lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with us. Michael will be here too. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? Tofu, tuna, and pineapple flavor. Uh, 
Now there's two things that don't belong in the same sentence, let alone on the same pizza. You're kidding, right? If we're talking pizza, then I am dead fucking serious. So, I'll see you come evening? Of course I'll be there. Yo. Life's pointless, anyway. Looking to get chipped. Mm-hmm. And? And? What? You're a ripper, aren't you? Yes. For my people. I'll make it worth your while. Is that so? Worth it by how much?
Welcome back. So, ready? Rogue should be here any minute. Okay. I'm ready. About fucking time. Look a little different. Fuss with your hair or... Fuck, it's good to be back. Never knew you'd got off somewhere. What's your poison? Tequila old-fashioned. Top it up with beer. And sprinkle in some chili. Silverhand special. Why well, hasn't anyone ordered that? Give me another. You got it. Cash's rider. They mean anything to you? Mm-hmm. Tattoo guy. How do you know that? We go back. Where'll I find him? Got a salon in Watson, Pershing Street. So what'll it be? Billy Goat or the other one? Other one. He's gonna love it. <laughs> sure he will. Jeremiah Grayson. Hmm. Heard he's an operator for Smasher. But you didn't hear that from me. Hey, who are you again? Yeah. Could say we had something in common. <laughs> Ruby Collins. Sloppy second for Grayson. After I banged her. Drink Slinger. I got something better. Hey, you rule me. What? You've heard about me? Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. Just got a little biz to take care of first. Anywhere with you. She's on that clock. Got it? Fuck, I missed this. Be waiting outside. Are you waiting for me? Let's go back to my place. Look, 
good on you. Got a light? I'll call. I'll call. Ruby, focus. I need to talk to Grayson. Hello, Night City. Blood first thing every morning. Ugh, talk about something else, please. Sure. The first time you walked up, since there was something familiar about you. Blah blah. Johnny told you. Did we? Uh. You know. No. Gunk was too drunk. He called me early morning. Of course, I thought it was you. And I thought, cute kid. It's too bad he's gone completely whacked. Came to see for yourself, huh? Morbid curiosity? Mm-hmm. And I found Johnny Silverhand. Smasher. He tell you about him? Yes. Didn't know he'd come back to NC. Johnny found some way to get at him. Wait. Grayson. Jeremiah Grayson. Works for Smasher. Johnny got a tip off some stripper, don't ask me how. Ebonike. Just that. Still, let me see what I can do. We're gonna get that son of a bitch. Can I help at all? In your state? <laughs> You're useless. Almost. I'll buzz you when I learn something. Okay. Unbelievable that bastard somewhere in your head. Puking right now. Yeah, well, life ain't fair. Yeah, you sure picked the right moment to bolt out of my body. Ought to be happy I left it all. Oh, I am. Look at me. Spewing joy in rainbows. Like a fucking ray of sunshine. Well, we moving? Place where you can puke all over the carpet, no problem. Beggar, not chooser.
started to think you wouldn't show. Shouldn't have, to be honest. Why not? Normally only work with fixers. Clients that avoid them tend to be bad news. I just care about my privacy. Fuck me. It's you. It's me, Lizzie Wizzy. Sit, please. Let's talk. Okay, so what's this about? I think you can guess. I'm in trouble. Mm-hmm. And what kind? <sighs> been a rough year. Creative block. Can't even say the last time I made anything worth listening to. And I fell in love. It's not the worst thing in the world. It is to me. I have something to say. And that? It's a distraction. So? Oh shit, these hands. Sometimes it seems like I just brush something and sparks fly. <sighs> anyway, a man. His name's Liam. Liam Northam. Been together a few months, but... Liam Northam. Forty-ish, sensitive, guy who never wanted for anything. Heard they exist. I know. I know how it sounds. I never meant to. He's not even... But... Your body can be chrome, but the heart never changes. It wants what it wants. So what's my role here? What do you want? Proof. And then I'll end it. Liam goes to Riot all the time. I think he meets... You'll find out for me? Can count. Perfect. Remember... I want specifics. Details. Recordings or pics if you can. Sure. Keep it in mind. Good. Now go. Where you going? Club's closed. Looking for a guy. Name's Liam. Liam Northam. You know where I could find him? No, you can fuck off, Merc. I ain't talking. Listen, it's important. I'm sure. 
to you, me, couldn't give a flying fuck. My, oh my. Look at him. So handsome. Hey, Linda. Champagne to the VIP room. Step. Okay, just let me give three their check. Looking for Liam. Liam North. Ah, oh, that one. 
one. Fuck. Bad tipper? Uh-huh. Plus, he's a j- Output, huh? Interesting. You know I can't. Can't, huh? But know what I can do? Think if you really want to say no. Use that s In the VIP room with some new output. Or to champagne, so it's a party. But, um, you didn't hear it from me, yeah? Sure. Ah. What is that? Whoa. <laughs> Right. Let's see what's here. Hey, what the hell are you doing here? Oh, sorry. Wrong room. Very wrong. Get lost before I call security. Get the hell out! Or I'm gonna call security. Oh, fuck. fuck. You heard what I just heard, no right? No privacy. Huh. Guy's cheating. Bet my life. Don't know. I mean, he's up to something, no doubt. But that back there, that was about something else. Minor deets. Either way, she better keep away from him. She might not take you at your word. Mm -hmm. That's why I gotta collect the security cam footage.
Hello? V? What's up? Got some intel on Liam. And? Is it what I thought? Yeah, it looks that way. Caught him in the VIP room with some chick. Ordered champagne. And? What do they talk about? Can't say. Don't think they talk for long, though. Mm, it's not much, but it's enough. Hey V, the NCPD got a call about a cyber psycho and actually sent a patrol this time, but work. it's been a few hours with no report back. Either those cops got scared and bounced or... Anyway, could you check it out for me? Be much appreciated. Hey V, come on in. Pizza's getting cold. We're in the kitchen. You made it, good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. <laughs> yeah, respect. Feed in itself from what I've seen in place. Just been lucky, I guess. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? So then, what's the plan? Need to wait for Michael. Feeling better? You look better. I'm on autopilot. I don't think. Just do. Sound method. You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? It suddenly comes naturally to you, doesn't it? Yeah, odd, given how much work I gotta put into it. Done saying hello to each other? Revolution won't plan itself. 
I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. You'll air it out later. Fine, I'll sit by the window. The body will react as if executing a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on top. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Tech that's all pros and no cons, I don't... Combat mode auto-initiates when a threat is present, and... Can't find a workaround. And that's it. I don't know. Only way to determine that would be through months of testing. There's an ethical side, too. You can murder... All right. Finally, someone said it. Tom? <sighs> Pulled that sequence from a kung fu training virtue. I'd admit, not bad. Yeah, for the market square in Kabuki. Uh, before we start talking serious biz, gonna need to see serious action. You just saw him. I saw a bar trick. Got an expert. V? Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. It's on now! What the? Ah. You there? Can you hear me? <laughs> Look at me go! You see that? Woo! Okay, do some okay. cardio. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sat... Where do we find this Hiromi? At his apartment. H8 Mega Tower. Topmost floor. It's a penthouse almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us in. Wouldn't it be better to ambush him in the street, like while he's chomping on a scop dog or taking a piss in the back alley? Why even try breaking into a penthouse? He's probably crawling with guards. Hiromi don't go anywhere without security. So one, makes no difference. Two, this is only a show of force demonstrating what we are capable of. Which is a lot more. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? I... I need to think about it. Never... I'm with it all the way. V? Don't tell me you're serious. Count me in, Judy. I already said I'd help. Thanks, V. Save the... Oh. I'll set up to meet with Hiromi and let you know. I need a couple days. Have fun. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. Feel a migraine coming on. Oh, shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do, well, usually comes with a price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. Judy? For real? No, don't want to hear it. But uh, be, be, Not a word. Uh, uh, uh. V, everything okay? V? Uh, uh, okay. Okay, I'm better. I'm fine. What the hell, V? You, like, sick? 
Remember the heist Evelyn hired us for? The relic I was gonna clep. <sighs> Couldn't forget that in a million years. That biochip. Well, long story short, it had Johnny Silverhand's mind on it. An engram of it that's overriding my mind. You being serious? Truly wish I wasn't. Fuck. Anything at all you can do? One can hope. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Sounds great. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home. to the bottom of Ebonica. Flicked pings to some contacts. Grayson buzzed familiar for a friend from the olden days. He did some digging. Found something. A section of the docks that's maelstrom turf. Meaning you found Grayson? He really got an end with Smashing. Come see me. Afterlife. We'll talk. Okay. <laughs> 